Hello Air Science, Gemini, Libra and Aquarius, welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea, thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. In this reading, we are going to find out what have people been talking about you lately. And this is a collective reading for Air Signs. And if you were divinely guided to watch this video, this message is specifically for you, even if you are dealing with the same Air Sign, okay? Spirits and angels, please show me four air signs, Gemini, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. What have people been talking about air signs lately? Wow, really, really good things, uh, air signs. Um, and these people can be anybody, okay? These people can be people who watch your social media, if you have social media, if you're active on it. Could be friends, family, um, co-workers. One second. <coughs> Sorry about that. Could be co-workers, um, exes, um, bosses, if you have anybody all right so there's somebody here who could be talking about how much they love you with the knight of cups one second <coughs> let me drink some water and i don't want to start over this reading because it looks really really good one second Sometimes I start over a reading because I cough way too much, but this one looks too good, so I'm not going to start over. Sorry about the cough. But anyway, um, some improvement, Five Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, and whatever. Somebody could be talking about how, with the Eight of Pentacles here, just how hardworking you are and that you deserve everything that you are achieving or have already achieved with a star here. Somebody could literally also be talking about how famous you are if you are a famous air sign. Um, but the star also can indicate how perhaps um, feels connected to your work, right? With eight of pentacles here and the knight of pentacles in one verse. Um, the star is also major arcana. So for me, any major arcana indicates change. So somebody could be talking about how you have changed, but changed for the better change for the positives okay for the positive because nine of pentacles and one verse can indicate something is picking up okay something is picking up like you no longer are the same because the nine of pentacles is supposed to be somebody very stable so it feels like very routine like same old same old but then it's in reverse now so feels like you're not the same anymore that's my interpretation and eight of pentacles it's because you've worked really really hard for this change with the star and you have achieved it already or will be achieving it or you're just on your way to achieving something that you've always wished for to change or maybe it could be somebody who could be wishing for you to change something and they could be talking about how uh, you work really hard on yourself and that you've made these changes and they're really happy about it, okay? Um, it could mean that as well. Just take what resonates with you. There will be a lot of specific, uh, specifics in this reading. So, again, just take what resonates with you. So, Five Pentacles in Reverse indicates um, a return for some of you, okay? That could be somebody talking about how they would like to return to you because they love you and if this alone this person lives far away they could be talking to their friends <clears throat> that they would like to go see you with the page of wands page of wands is an, is an explorer somebody adventurous so to me it's associated with travel so this person could be talking about traveling towards you how they can't wait how much excited they are because eight of wands is right here too so this could indicate some sort of fast fast movement perhaps it could be travels um so this person has been somebody here 
This person could be a, a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpio. Could be also a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, Aquarius. Can be any sign, fixed signs here. Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. All I know, these people are all the same person. But if it's a different person, I feel like one, two, three, four people could be talking about you. <laughs> four different people could be talking about you. But they're all good things, Taurus signs. Eight of Wands, on the star here, like. It feels like some sort of achievement. They say something very passionate about you, something how desirable you are. Somebody could also be talking about how attractive you are lately. Maybe you've made some changes to yourself. May or may not. The attractiveness may not always mean external attractiveness. It could indicate internal attractiveness as well because the star is, you know, it's a renewal as well. So maybe you again maybe you have changed the way you speak the way you see life the way you communicate with people mm, it just feels brand new to me there's something really brand new about you that i feel like again you have put in a lot of effort and work into it or you've spent a lot of money on it okay <laughs> for some of you the eight of pentacles you know it can indicate something that is physical as well so Somebody could be talking about your new shiny brand new, huh, or they said new, your new shiny car, okay, your brand new shiny car. If you bought a car, something that is shiny, somebody could also be talking about uh, your jewelry, something is shiny, okay, or if you change your hair color, especially to like a lighter hair color, like blonde, so it looks much shy, like it looks shinier because of that, I don't know. So it could be that, air signs, um, that somebody could be talking about something new that you have bought or it's just you being brand new um, or change of hair color. It feels like a lighter hair color, okay, if that's for some of you, like how the new hair color or the new hairstyle actually suits you really well and how, how attractive you look. And for some of you, the star also can indicate, you know, the Knight of Pentacles here looks... And if you compare here to here, this is this looks smaller, this looks slightly bigger. So uh, somebody could be talking about how much weight you have lost. Okay, that's for some of you. How much weight you've lost, how diligent you have been, Eight of Pentacles, with your diet, or perhaps workout if you've been working out. Because the Nine of Pentacles and Mopers, you know, if it's in an upright position, then it's stationary, not moving, because this horse is not actually moving. But when it's in reverse, it's like moving. So some sort of a movement. So it could be related to a gym. Okay, for some of you, you've been going to a gym. Or there could be people at the gym talking about how attractive you are. If you are one of those air signs who would go to the gym every day or almost every single day. Okay, if you've been working on your body, yeah, that's what I'm getting at. So we got the Wheel of Fortune, Page of Cups. There's a very friendly energy I'm getting here. Maybe lately you've been very friendly to someone in particular. I feel like this person could be talking about their encounters with you, their conversations with you. Um, maybe you've met this person while you've, you, you've been traveling with the Wheel of Fortune here, or you've met this person online, mm, or you've met this person at work, Eight of Pentacles, or it may, it may be related to work or finances, anything. But I do sense this person talking about how lucky they are to have met you. Maybe you've opened up their eyes. Uh, maybe you've inspired them with a page of wands here. Inspire them to make some changes or to take risks. Um, to be, to actually be more driven. That's what I'm hearing. All right, one second. Let me pull out more cards here. The emperor can indicate a person. This could be an Aries person. For those of you dealing with an Aries here, this person could also be talking about how you're confusing them lately to a swords. This person could also be a Pisces, a Scorpio, Libra, Gemini, Chris. This person will be talking about how confusing you've like you've been giving this person uh, mixed signals or that they are confused about what you want. They're trying to figure you out and with the two of swords here, Mm, you may have blocked this person. I don't know. I'm getting this. You may have blocked somebody out because you're focusing on yourself, right? Healing and recovery with the star here and eight of pentacles. It may be, it could be you focusing on yourself or focusing on your work. 
or everything, everything else other than this person. So they could be talking about how um, they could be talking about how you could be bossing up right now as well with the emperor. If this could be, I mean, the emperor could be you as well, right? You embodying the emperor energy here, just bossing up. Uh, because the Eight of Pentacles here indicates maybe you you work really hard. For those of you who has, for those of you who have a business as well. For those of you who have a business and you are selling clothes or selling things, um, somebody could be talking about, wow, there are a lot of options. Seven of Cups here, so many good options, right? And maybe for some of you, if you have a new website, I know this very specific, that's just for some of you. If you have a new website, somebody could be talking about how your website looks good and you have a lot, there are a lot of options. It's very user friendly and that um, they would like to buy something from you. That is very specific again, that is not for all of you, but Air Science, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius, this is your reading. Hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm going to leave you with two playlists on the screen right now. The first one is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. Check it out if you want to. And the second playlist is from this channel. It has all of the readings that I've done for you and for the rest of the signs with different topics and different questions. But these readings are still new, so they're still relevant as I post them almost every single day. But anyway, take care, Air Science. Hope to see you back here again tomorrow. Bye.